Hey guys, welcome back to Mr. Gab's Gaming Channel. Today we're going to be talking about how to improve your aim and reaction using Aim Labs, okay? Uh, the task that I use in Aim Labs was Grid Shot Ultimate, which you can find under, uh, you hit Tasks, then under Flicking, you scroll down just a tiny bit, and there it is on your left hand corner. It's Grid Shot Ultimate, okay? Uh, I did the way I improved my aim and reaction was doing a 30 day training uh, session or schedule uh, for 30 days straight. I did one hour of grid shot ultimate. Okay. On this video, you're going to see the average scores and some of the scores that uh, I have during this uh, 30 day challenge or 30 day experiment. Now, I am not telling you to do one hour training session each day for 30 days. However, you can do 20. 30 minutes, however long you want to do these training sessions, okay? My point is you can use Aim Labs Great Shot Ultimate to improve your aim, your your aim and your reaction. Okay, it's all about practice. So that is pretty much the answer to this video. Alright. Now without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and get started. So I hope you guys enjoyed the content. Let's roll it. So first we're going to start with day one, first game and last game. This is just for baseline purposes, okay? Um, on my first game, I had a score of 50,000 as well as an average 50,000. 50, last game um, was 61, 2, I mean 200,000 and then 56.1 thousand on the average. Gave me, an, gave me an increase on the score of 22% and then uh, an increase of the average of 12%. Okay, now we're going to go with one uh, week one um, this is the data uh, the data that I collected on day one if you see a negative it means that my last game score was bef uh, under the average that I established that day um, on week one I had an increase of my average of 38 percent which was the highest increase on my average I'm on all of the days and weeks of this uh, challenge or, or experiment rather okay now for week two, I had two days of negatives, uh, which again, like I said, uh, went under my score was under the uh, established average of that day. Okay, the negative were on day eleven and day twelve, and then I had an increase of uh, fifteen percent uh, to my average amount in this week alone. Okay. Now with uh, week three, this is the week that I suffered the most because one, there is days that I did not record the data because I really simply just forgot to record the data. So um, I don't have a lot of data to go with. Uh, I had three days of negatives and then my increase of the average is 3% again because I didn't have the uh, data. This is the week that I really, really struggled to go up in numbers. Now on week four, uh, this is the week that I had the third best increase average. Um, this is also the week that I had my best game so far. And I have two, I think it's two negative on this week during this experiment. And I had an increase of 9% uh, among the uh, days here. Hey fellas, I'm back. Okay, so now that you've seen the data, right? That's all the math, all the juju, that scientist stuff that I, I, I'm actually not interested in. However, you might be interested. I'm giving you the reason of why and the numbers of why and how M Labs work, okay? So just to summarize, these are the weekly increase uh, in percentage, okay? So week one is that 38%, okay? Week two is that 15%, all right? Week three is that three percent, and then week four is that nine percent. Okay, now I'm gonna give you the daily, the weekly average, and then at the end of this, of course, the 30 day uh, increase average. Okay, so daily I had pretty much an average increase of 2.5 percent. All right, weekly I had an increase of around 18 19 percent and then of course my 30-day increase will be around 76 75 percent increase uh this is all based on that 50,000 of my baseline so there you go okay and then for the score i had an increase of around 55 uh percent okay 55 56 percent 
uh, my best score is going to be linked on the description down below that is it really for this video i hope you guys enjoy the content um this is does your question is does aim labs work to answer that question yes aim labs does work for sure my aim got better uh, my reaction got better right so i hope you guys enjoy the content i hope you guys enjoy this video all the math the scientists everything I hope you guys get uh a good firm a good uh uh understanding on how aim labs work and what was this video about uh hopefully you guys get to use it and get better right um if you enjoy the content you can catch me on twitch okay twitch on uh, my the twitch link is on the description down below i stream every monday wednesday and friday at 4 p.m central time which is 5 p.m eastern standard time okay or 6 p.m uh puerto rico and I stream on Saturdays at 3 p.m. Okay, Central Time, right? Catch me, don't, don't lose it, all right? I like to talk to chat. I stream mostly Apex. Anyway, if you enjoyed the content, please make sure to subscribe to the channel. Make sure to share the channel. That way it helps me uh, reach others about how they can improve their aim and their reaction, okay? Make sure you hit to that subscribe button and that bell notification. That way you can get notified of when I get a new video. All right, hope you guys enjoy, and as always, catch me next time. Peace.